Aloha, Legacy family, and welcome once again to Witness in a Minute, where the goal is to provide you the tools and encouragement to carry out the Great Commission. A few months ago, I noticed that Christmas decorations were up already, and it was even before Halloween. So I said to my wife, look, Thanksgiving is almost here. My wife said, Thanksgiving? No, it's almost Christmas. Those are Christmas decorations. So if you see Christmas is close, then Thanksgiving is even closer. As we look at end times events, we might say, wow, the Antichrist is near. That's true, but it also means the return of Jesus Christ is even closer. So what do we do with the fact that Jesus Christ could come back at any time? How are we to live? We find the answer in 1 Thessalonians 5, 6 through 8. Paul wrote, so be on your guard, not asleep like the others. Stay alert and be clear headed. Night is a time when people sleep and drinkers get drunk. But let us who live in the light be clear-headed, protected by the armor of faith and love, and wearing as our helmet the confidence of our salvation. Instead of walking in the Spirit, it seems as though some people in the church are sleepwalking. They're not watching for the signs of the times. They have a certain passiveness or maybe even laziness about them. There's a disconnect between their personal lives and their spiritual lives. And Titus 2 12 through 13, the Bible says, And we are instructed to turn from godless living and sinful pleasures. We should live in this evil world with wisdom, righteousness, and devotion to God, while we look forward with hope to that wonderful day when the glory of our great God and Savior, Jesus Christ, will be revealed. God doesn't give us the truth of His Word merely to hoard it. He gives it to us to share. We are blessed to be a blessing. God wants us to take the truth He has put in our lives and work it through us. He wants us to share it with others. So, don't be a spiritual sleepwalker. Wake up, pay attention, and be ready for the Lord's return. And may God bless your next adventure as you witness in a minute. Aloha.